dun dun dun. See if it fixes the problem, boys. A race fuel valve. I don't know if I'd go quite that far, but <laughs> cool. Let's get her on there. Okay, uh, I wanted to just quickly show you guys why I'm going to be putting this in. Make a little before and after just with the fuel rail pl plug. Only thing we're really looking at right here is the fuel pressure actual versus fuel pressure desired. And at 100% throttle, it is asking for about, call it 17,000 to 12,000. Then 21,000 to 12,000. 21.7 to 12.5, you get the point, 22. So that's a big difference. It's almost, what, half? Half of what we actually need in there. So obviously a lift pump is the number one thing we need, but I don't have that yet. So we're gonna put the fuel rope plug in, and we're gonna do a uh, before and after. So I just ran this yesterday, and those were the results, and uh, now we're going to put this in there. And then I'll run it again and we'll test it. Now let's go put it in there. Mm. Diesel. Diesel, diesel, diesel. Perfect. Want to give you guys a little insight on uh, doing a data log inside the Cummins. She's just warming up a little bit. We got all of our EFI Live and our phone down there out of the way. Uh, we just got done putting the plug in. So, um, yeah, just want to show you guys that. It's uh, recording right now, so that way I can review it later. So I'm not actually looking at this while I'm driving. If you were as curious as I ever was, there's your answer of how to really get a good idea of what's going on with your truck. See you soon. Okay, hello there. Just got back from the test drive with the new fuel rail plug and wanted to show you guys the pretty shocking results actually. The problem that we had before was that the fuel rail pressure actual, oh man, my computer screen's falling apart, uh, was a lot less than the desired. All right, 35 miles an hour, 100% throttle. Our actual, 27.7. And our desired was 25.5, so that's higher. So that's good. Uh, here we go, a little bit faster. We're at 70 miles an hour, 40% throttle. And again, our actual is more than our desired. And, uh, you know, not to beat this over with a stick, but see, I got real 
wild with her for a second. So 87 miles per hour, 100% throttle. Our actual 22,200 is barely less, sorry, not barely, but 26,100 was the desired. So in sixth gear, going ham, 100 foot to the floor, 90 miles an hour, that pressure is a lot higher than with the stock um, fuel rail plug. So I know there's a lot of controversy and this, that, and the other, and I get that, but I'm just looking at that and I'm saying, well, shit, that's a lot closer than what it was before when it was like less than half and uh, no codes were thrown. So take a look at your fuel rail plug, check it out, Google it yourself. But yeah, just wanted to share those results with you guys. Peace and love.